What objects give meaning to our lives? KPBS reporter Maya Trabulsi talked to an artist who gathered things special to San Diego residents and preserved them as 3D laser art. It's part of our Arts and Culture series, Canvas. When you walk into the New Americans Museum, you may wonder where the art exhibit is. But if you look closer, you'll see a penknife, a bell, a figurine, and if you look even closer, you will learn about the stories embedded in these objects. Each one of these individual stories come together as a, as a chorus, in my view. Carrie Ann Quick is the artist in residence when you, here. When you start with something specific, something completely surprising can unfold, something you never would have access to otherwise. Something specific like a typewriter. Like a typewriter, yes, yes. For her exhibit called A Portrait of People in Motion, she spent over a year gathering treasured objects from San Diego residents. But more importantly, she gathered the stories that accompany them. If we can feel some of that um, emotion about what it's like to try to figure out how to live in a new place, then maybe we can empathize with those who are experiencing the most extreme version of that discomfort. The item is scanned and then 3D printed or laser engraved to leave behind what Carrie Ann calls a ghost. Transparent with faint detail, yet still teeming with the story of how it came to San Diego. The story is the art piece. The objects that are represented here, they're just a way in to those stories. And yes, the objects are transparent and that's on purpose. Some objects are made of clear resin, others are acrylic. The light, as it projects through the laser engraved surface, it creates a shadow where the writing almost becomes legible. At first glance, they're hard to see against the stark white wooden furniture designed to look like furniture in a home. But looking closer is exactly what Carrie Ann wants you to do. And when they look closer and they wonder what that what the thing is that they're looking at, they are given access to the story that is behind it. Carrie Ann also recorded the oral histories of each piece that can be played by dialing a number on your phone. Welcome to a portrait of people in motion. And then the corresponding number of the item. My object is a jacket that uh, when I was in Korea during the Korean War, this was a jacket that uh, I in effect stole from the army. From 1971 to now, and we've lived many places and the recipes have gone with me. My object is a little tiny Inuit figure that was given to me in 1945 by my first boyfriend who was stationed in the Aleutians. And I think just seeing it makes me feel at home because I grew up seeing it. The crux of what I'm trying to do here is to help people, people in general, feel something that might make them treat their neighbor a little bit better. And as the sound of plane engines roar above this little museum under the San Diego flight path, it offers a subtle reminder that we are all people in motion. For the PBS NewsHour, I'm Maya Trabulsi in San Diego.